Counter-terror police are investigating after two police officers were injured while arresting a man with a knife outside Buckingham Palace. Officers saw a large bladed weapon in the man's car when it stopped near the palace on Friday evening. As they arrested him, both men suffered minor arm injuries, police said. The 26-year-old man was also treated for minor injuries. He was arrested on suspicion of grievous bodily harm and assault, and under the Terrorism Act, no members of the royal family were in Buckingham Palace at the time. A palace spokesman said summer opening hours and tours will go ahead on Saturday, adding that it will be business as usual. The incident happened outside the mall roundabout near Spur Road, which runs along the corner of the palace grounds, at about 2035 BST, police said, the man had stopped his car in a restricted area, and police saw the weapon, DET SUP Guy Collings said the quick and brave actions of the officers meant the man was detained very quickly, and that no members of the public had any contact with him, the two officers and the suspect have been discharged from hospital. The suspect was taken to a central London police station for questioning. Inquiries into the full circumstances are ongoing, police added, and there was still a police cordon at the scene. Eyewitness Kiana Williamson said, We turned up and there was one police van and one car. There was also a civilian's car that had veered towards the police car, they were trying to get the man out of the car, shouting, more. Police were arriving onto the scene and the man was fighting back. I saw one injured policeman with an injury to his arm, although it didn't look severe. He was being tended to by another officer. The man had been restrained and looked almost unconscious by the side of the road. Another passerby, who did not want to be named, said her partner initially thought he had seen a sword. She told the press association, the police didn't just run up to the car. There was some shouting prior to this. I couldn't tell you what. I was a bit panicked. My partner saw a sword, which I didn't see, as well as a policeman with blood on him, looking like his hand or chest was injured. The police officer had it in his hand, walking away with it.